Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss what bulk insert in MongoDB database. So first I am going to show you the collection that I am going to use. So add here write to db and here dot here you can find dpt collection and if you place uh, add here dot here you can find and here find. Now if you execute to this query so see add here this is the contents record inside or dpt collection. Now here after the next thing is so add here one more thing so add here I'm using a studio 3t for mongodb or you can write add here uh, cmd and here you can write the same query inside a command prompt also so it's executing the same query you can write inside command prompt also now here after the next thing is so first I'm going to show you the simple insert operation so add here write db dot and here you can find dept now if you press add here insert i and so add here at this point you can find insert insert many insert one so let's see one by one so first i'm going to show you about the insert so insert and here open and cu close curly braces so add here the first is dpt number so add here going to write at this point dept number and here here after colon and here so this is the integer tab so add here giving the value 50 okay now here after so if you execute this query so see at here there is a one insert operation so it's a one uh, dpt number uh, 50 inserted at here or you can try to uh, fill all uh, this all others value also so let's copy that one and here or db dot and here after next or uh, is the d name so write at here d name and here column so d name is the string tab so at here going to write at this point or uh, d name hr hr now here after next is loc loc colon and here it's a also a string term so we should give double code and you're going to write manchester now so add here we can insert multiple values now here after let's execute and check so see at here write result one so one inserted now check the so see at here 50 hr manchester that is inserted now here after the next two thing is so like this and suppose if i enter so see at here this is the insert okay now here after i'm going to copy this and here going to paste at this position and you're only going to change dpt number 80 and here so going to write self and here city boston so boston now here after going to do the modification at this point also 70 and here and here d name or oh, that is so uh, science or you should write it and here or oh, at this point going to give location boston so boston turn let's write at here forward now if you execute to this query so see at here one in inserted now check the output so see at here oh, 50 oh, sorry 70 and here dnm it and ho ho lo location forward it's uh, inserted but at here this value uh, did not didn't inserted so for this we need to use at here insert many so here let's copy that one and here if you write db so db and here if you press dot here after dpt now if you press add here dot here you can find insert may insert insert many so about the insert insert a document 
or a, a document into a collection and here document past insert and here we can only insert one record one at a time here now here auto let's use many so many insert multiple document into the collection so we can insert multiple document now here after that paste that things so in place of uh, insert going to use insert many okay so insert many now here after close this one also now insert many at this point i'm going to record insert two records so 70 already exists so let's give add here or new name like uh, 90 is not there d name going to give id and here ct going to insert miami and this volume not inserted at here let's execute this query so at here i'm getting some kind of error masters tv dot insert document not a function okay let's rectify tv dot to insert many and here after we need to use uh, at this point a uh, uh, bracket also this bracket and here this bracket this bracket that is required at this point now here after let's make it down now here this bracket required so that will dpt number 90 and here this all those things are same and here after let's go down so this value going to insert multiple values now execute this query so this time two inserted like this you can insert two four five six seven eight whatever you like now let's check that so add here the value that is that i just inserted of 90 and 80 id miami sales boston this value that i inserted so this is the way we can insert a uh, bulk uh, values like many values at there you can just uh, just give the comma here after you can insert many now that's the uh, uh, copy that i'm going to say give the comma and you have to paste it here so if you execute to uh, this query okay so if you let's give uh, insert or duplicate values so at here this time four inserted now if you want to check so at here execute to this query so this will give you at here for value that I just inserted 90 80 90 80 now hereafter you can perform bulk insert by different ways also so add here let's write where and here uh, give the where name so going to get give out here bulk where so bulk where now here after comma and from here let's copy that one Okay, copy from here and uh, paste it down. Okay, so oh, and here after close by semicolon. So this value is going to initialize inside or going to store into bulk variable. Now here after so dpt number 90, let's give add here or some unique values like add here giving thousand and here. 800 now here at this point going to enter 900 and uh, here 700 now here after let's so uh, leave this all same so add here dpt number and here dp d name so this is separated so this is the one record at this point and here this is so the uh, see at here this is the one record and here this is the second here third and here this is the fourth so fourth record going to store into bulk variable execute and check so see and here there is no any error masters now here after i'm going to uh, insert the value so first that all value that is store into bulk var now here after the next uh, thing is so let's write at here db and here dot so you can find dpt collection now here after the next thing write insert insert here you can find insert now 
uh, right to add here this. So insert this things. Now paste it down. Give add here bulk variable only. Now add square to this query again. So see add here four inserted. That means four value inserted into our collection DEPT. Now if you want to check, so see add here 1800, 900 and 700. Now here after, so this is the second way we can insert um, many multiple values inside the collection. So we need to use add here var. Here after keep the any var name and here this value store we have to store into uh, this var. Here after we need to use dpt dot or db dot dpt insert and here give the bulk var name. So after that, that's the value multiple value inserted. Now here after the next thing is so add here db dot so dpt and here you can find insert so this is the insert one so add here insert a document into a collection so all document or collection okay so only we can insert one so add here if i'm going to give add here insert one okay so writing o and a now here after so let's give add here this values name like uh, 12 thousand now here going to enter here 1890 so this uh, two values going to insert us now here after execute to this query so add here there is a uh, two and here this only one inserted now if you want to check so here let's write uh, uh, let's execute this query now here after so see add here I try to insert two values like uh, or this one and here this one but it's only inserted one because at here insert one it's only insert one or document inside the collection so this is the way we can uh, use at here insert insert one insert many so to bulk insert you can use uh, this kind of or query or you can uh, store on uh, the variable at here after that you can insert okay so I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.